And time is running out in the search for a hiker whose belongings were found in the Far East County. 28 year old Chris Sylvia hasn't been seen in over a week, but his identification and hiking gear have been found. The discovery was made about 13 miles off State Route 79, which is just north of Warner Springs. 10 News reporter Michael Chen is joining us. And Michael, you just learned that he called his roommate just before disappearing. That's right. Uh, we now know that the Vista man reached out to his roommate days into his hike and even picked out a specific meeting point, but Sylvia never showed up. By air, on foot, and on horseback, search teams combed a rugged area north of Warner Springs. In the past hour, the Sheriff's Department released this photo taken from Chris Sylvia's driver's license recovered by hikers. There is also some sobering news about his food supply. Sylvia began his hike nearly two weeks ago. And he was going to be hiking for about a week. He didn't really have a set, a set plan. Uh, he had about a week's worth of food. Sylvia started his hike February 12th after his roommate dropped him off in Anza. On the 17th, he called his roommate to pick him up at a Buddhist temple in Warner Springs, but Sylvia was a no-show. His friend thought he had just gone on ahead, but when Sylvia didn't show up at his final destination, Campo, the friend called the sheriff's department and the search began. This morning, hikers found his ID and gear in a remote area about 13 miles north of Warner Springs. Some camping gear, some uh, water purifier, some clothing, uh, uh, a tarp for camping, for hiking, and a, a sleeping pad. After a day-long search, no signs of Sylvia, who is believed to be an experienced hiker. We checked the weather data, and while the days have been mild, the last few nights have reached below freezing temperatures. And we're told the search, which does include a Border Patrol team using dogs, will be suspended at sunset. It will start back up tomorrow morning. Michael Chen, 10 News.